Hey everybody, welcome back to Covers and Commentary, and welcome back to another episode of Drummer Reacts. And this is a video that I am cautiously optimistic about. So this is an Elisa Pario Sabriano drum cover, but it's a drum cover of the song Everlong by Foo Fighters. And this song and that entire album, The Color and the Shape that Everlong is from, is, is really important to me. Uh, it's actually the album that I would play from start to finish. That was my sort of practice to teach myself how to become more consistent with drums. I would literally listen to that album on loop, and when I knew that I was a good enough drummer to play for other people was when I could play through that album. I don't know if I can still do it now, but <laughs> that's what I used to be able to do. And with Taylor Hawkins having passed away, even though he was actually not the recording drummer, most people don't know that, he wasn't the recording drummer for Everlong, but it is so synonymous with him because of the way he would play it live. And it's just, when, when he passed away, I got a tattoo of the symbols in the background of the color and the shape of my leg. He was one of the drummers that influenced me the most. Um, and so I'm cautious but optimistic about this because I know how Ellis Sparrow tends to like to overplay. But we'll see how he does with this song. Let's dive in. One of the best rock drummers of our time. Yeah, that's true. I'm already getting emotional. This freaking song, man. Okay. Yeah. No way. I'm gonna cry. He's playing it well. We're just we're just in the verse right now, but he's playing it exactly the way that it's supposed to be played. Yeah. He is he's literally playing it exactly the way it's supposed to be played. I don't know if the two symbol thing is well I can see it. Here we go. I'm actually... He's... He's playing it exactly the way it's supposed to be played. He's not overplaying it. That is exactly how this song should be played, and I love it. Yeah, get the tom. Yes! Yes! That is... That is... Yes! That is how I play it, too. Oh, gosh. <laughs> oh, my God, he's doing it exactly right. I want to hear that. I want to just I want to see him play that chorus again. Oh my god, yes, he's just... <laughs> oh. I don't know if it's, I don't know if it's, I mean, from what he said at the start, with Taylor Hawkins being one of the best rock drummers of our generation, I mean, he's, he's not wrong. 
I'm wondering if that's why he's playing it exactly, exactly as it is, like exactly the way it was supposed to be played. Like, I'm wondering if he's doing that out of respect. Because I, I mean, I can think of so many ways he could have overplayed this, and he's not, which shows an incredible amount of well, precision and self control. Oh man. No, you've always been. God, those sixteenth notes go hard. So he's. So one of the things I think he is. I don't. Gosh, I can't think straight right now. I think he's playing the cymbals instead of the hi hat. Yeah, I think it's a hi hat, but the cymbals fit in here as well. And really, it, you know, with his level of energy, it works. Um, I can't think straight. <laughs> I was so expecting to go into this and be like, okay, like, I get it. It's it's cool and fast and fun, but like, come on. And he's just, he's literally playing it the way it's. This is great. I think, yeah, it's normally the hi hat, but I don't care. This is, this is, ah, uh, he's doing so well with this song. Oh, man. Uh, damn it. I'm not crying, you're crying. Oh, he's got the shakes. Oh, look at he's got. I wonder if that's from. Uh, I wonder if the. I wonder if he's got some little uh, nicks and cuts from whacking his finger on the snare drum. I've done that a couple times, and uh, yeah, never feels good. Never feels good. He makes drum rolls just seem so effortless. Oh, look at that. One more time. <sighs> yes. He's, uh, he's got to be doing this out of just respect, and I love it. It's it's perfect. <sighs> hey there, guys. How oh, are hey. you doing? I promise I'm not going to take much of your time, I'll but there are two take very as much important as you want. things that I need to say to you. I love right his merch. First I love one, that please merch. Please remember that you've got all of my new merchandise. We're literally talking about the merch right away. Store. As you know, all of these videos have copyright, yeah, so exactly. I don't make money out of them. So if you want to support the channel, maybe you can get something in exchange. Wouldn't that be beautiful? Also, I oh, wanted man. to say that as many of you know, I often overplay these songs, but I have a special kind of love for this one. It is my favorite rock song ever, and it was played by Taylor Hawkins who recently passed away so I didn't want to change anything on the song because if you ask me it is perfect so that being said please remember that I am taking requests on the comment section below please like and subscribe turn on the notifications drop a couple comments thank you so that's much for awesome. being here with me today I appreciate it a lot and I hope that's to awesome. see you all very soon guys on the next video stay safe oh, man. practice take care cheers <laughs> Oh my gosh. He, he played it exactly the way it was supposed to be played, and he did it because it was his favorite song. <laughs> oh my god. That actually, that took me so off guard. I was so expecting just a, like overplayed mess and he just got it perfect i 
I just hit the mic. Oh, man. I have nothing to say. Like, he played Everlong exactly as Everlong has played. He played it beautifully and completely honored and respected the original play of the song, the original recording of the song. What a guy. What a guy. I just... Man. I, I want to go play Everlong now. <laughs> I want to go play Everlong now. Uh, maybe I'll try to do a drum cover of that, but... Uh, I don't know. I feel like I couldn't make it through playing. I, I can barely make it through playing like some Foo Fighters songs now without getting emotional. It's rough. But uh, maybe I'll try it. Maybe I'll try it for you guys. Maybe I'll try it for you guys. If you, if you want that... Leave a comment below. Um, but, uh, yeah, just wow. Um, that's it. That's all I got. If you guys would want to go watch this uh, on its own without me talking or crying here in the corner, like, go ahead and check out the links in the description. And of course, I'll link his channel down there as well. Go show some love if you haven't already. Um, and that's, yeah. If you like what you saw here, uh, definitely leave it a like. Again, comment if you want me to try to play any of the songs from uh from uh <laughs> from the color and the shape and uh that's it that's it that's all i got thank you so much for watching and i hope to see you all in the next video thank you so much for being here and have a good one